Hello, beautiful, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're painting, but not with regular paint. <laughs> no. We're painting with hair color, this hair color right here. And we're not just painting with hair color, we're also painting with bleach. Why are you painting with bleach, Brad? Well, because <laughs> there's no such thing as a creamy white hair color. If you can find that somewhere, I will be very impressed, but it doesn't exist. So I'm using bleach as my white paint today. And as you guys know already what this video is about, I'm painting a Bob Ross painting. I'm gonna follow a Bob Ross tutorial. I sat down all day today prepping for this video because, well, there's no really easy way to paint with hair color because most of it is very runny and thin and the ones that are thick usually have conditioner in them, which means it's not gonna dry. I decided to go with Tintation, which looks like this because it seemed to have dried down on a piece of paper and it was a little thick. So hopefully this is gonna work because I'm really trying here. <laughs> and I really want this to work and I really want to make a nice painting for you and it'd be really cool to have a painting in my house that was made of only hair color. So hopefully this works out. And I know how to paint, so hopefully those skills just make it all come together even though th this is not real paint. But, 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 you guys, all my merch right now is 20% off. Every single item is 20% off. Get it now. We are completely getting rid of all stock. So if you want any of the pieces, then now is your time to get it because they're gonna be gone forever and ever and ever and ever. So get it now while you can. Fanjoy.co slash Brad, link below. And also one more thing before we start. <sighs> I just launched my own brand, X Mondo. I told you guys about it a few days ago and I am so excited about it. So if you haven't seen that launch video, um, it's very artsy and very me, actually. The other side of Brad that you guys don't see. That video will also be linked below. X Mondo is a brand that I've been working on for over a year now. I know I didn't really say much about what X Mondo is yet, but that is coming up, I promise, and it's very exciting, and it's something you guys have all been waiting for. So get ready for that. Follow it on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram for more updates for X Mondo. And sign up for the newsletter down below, xmondocare for updates when launch is happening. Okay, now you guys, let's get painting a Bob Ross painting. I'm very excited, let's do it. Oh, hello, are you ready to paint? Cause I am. Let's do it. Okay, as you can see, we have a lot of supply. You can't see that, can you? It's off, off camera. We have a lot of supplies. I really went in, okay? I'm trying to not half-ass this and really give you everything you've ever wanted with this. And yeah, so <laughs> I got the primary colors, red, yellow, and blue. That's right, I know what the primary colors are. I know color theory for all of you guys who don't think I do. I do know it and I do hair for a living. Thank you. And then I also got um, paint, uh, whatever this is, salmon. I, don't know, I had other colors laying around the house and I just decided to use them also. So, oh, also, if you're wondering like, Brad, why does this not look yellow on camera? Well, Tintation doesn't have a yellow, but it does have ginger, which it's sort of like a mustard yellow. So I thought, you know what? Hopefully that'll work. <laughs> so let's watch. Hey, glad you could join me today. Oh, you ready to do a thanks. fantastic little painting? Look. Yes. The canvas is already covered with a nice thin even coat of liquid white. It's all wet and slick. I'm going to have that. Okay. Midnight black. Okay, okay, okay. Black and blue. Let's put a happy little sky in here. I'm just going to like that. Little painting. I can do this. Little... All right, you guys. I'm going to mix up some blue and black. To make black, you just mix the three primary colors together and it makes black. So let's do that. How do I do it? I'm gonna take a little spatula because that's what I feel like you would do. And we're gonna hope that this orange <laughs> makes black when it's mixed with these other colors. Oh my God, I really hope I don't stain my ground today. My hardwood floors are so stained from all these color videos and I'm over it. Oh, that looks black. I'm actually really stoked for this. I do like painting, but I do prefer using <laughs> real paint. Oh, hey, it's actually like a decent consistency. Is that black? We don't really know. It looks definitely like a blackish color. Let's test it on a paper towel. Um, not quite black. So let's add a little bit more blue. Okay, that's kind of black. This looks actually like the blue he has. So we use this blue. Okay, Rob, Bobby, <laughs> I'm scared. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, this is actually working. It's mine's more like watercolor for sure, but something's happening. So how can I not be happy with that? Okay, mine's not getting lighter because I don't have that titanium white or whatever. Oh, 
Oh, I think I need a little water. I need water. Maybe the water will help it get lighter. Oh! <laughs> Genius, man. Okay. It's supposed to get lighter. Okay, yeah, great. There we go. I'm gonna leave a little area open. This look right good. Look like Wait, this looks oh good. Uh oh. Uh oh, Bob. I got the cheap brushes and I have. Bob, wait, Bob. Oh. Got it. I got the hair off. See how easy that is? No, I don't see how easy it is. I had real pain in the Bob. Okay, almost done with this. I promise. Oh, I like it. We can't. I just stop here. Bobino. It was looking good until it started dripping. You're a fantastic artist. Thank you. Okay, let me wash the brush. He's so sweet. Okay, this looks pretty similar to Bob's, and I'm thrilled about it. Right. Yeah, it looks good. I'm gonna leave a little area open right here. See how easy that is? I do. And that's the fun part. You'll enjoy that. <laughs> now then, clean, dry brush. What a weird oh, I love it. Why are we dripping? I want to know. Yo, it was looking good until we dripped. His paint fades out. Mine doesn't because I'm not using paint so it doesn't fade out. Okay, great. If we just ignore the drips, I think we're off to a good start. Oh, see, this is a, this is actually working. Whoa. I didn't quite believe in myself today, and I should have. That was where I was wrong. I down here in the water, very lightly. <gasps> just go all the way across. Are you sure? See that light area with Yo, this is risky. Let's take, let's take the old one inch brush and let's build a happy <gasps> cloud. This is working. <laughs> Bob was right, I should have trusted him. Like, this is beautiful. Okay, that looks bad. Dope. And you had to make a big decision. Where does a little cloud live in your world? Send Black first. and red? Whoa. Create as many or as few clouds in your world as you want. <laughs> How exciting. Let's dip into my ugly black and red. Okay, that looks like Bob's color. <gasps> Don't ruin it, Brad. It looks decent. All right. You know what? I should blow dry this first. That way the colors don't get all runny on each other. Okay, let's take the big moment. Now let's do the red. <laughs> oh boy. All right, Bob, I'm trusting you here. Making a big commitment. Uh oh, oh jeez. oh God. Hey, that kind of looks like Bob's cloud. Yo, that looks good. What the, man, wait. <laughs> I'm so happy. Other cloud, other cloud. Ready, Bob? Little Brenda over here. He wanted me to name them, so I'm gonna put it over here. Oh, that's not good. Okay, that looks kind of cloudish to me. Or it looks like little pieces of in the sky. Either one, I'm going with it. They can look at your paintings and tell when you were happy. They reflect your moods. Uh oh. Paintings are a reflection. My paintings don't look like I'm a raging bitch then. <laughs> Why don't we give that a shot with uh, bleach? You guys, I'm doing this. I was about to use, you know, like white paint. And then I was like, nah, man, if I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna fully do it. So I'm taking my bleach and I'm gonna put it right here a little bit. I'm gonna fully do this, but I'm just gonna mix it with water. For some reason, bleach smells a lot worse when it's mixed with water. I'm not even being dramatic, I can't breathe. <sighs> <laughs> I ended up mixing the bleach in a cup. So, um, let me dry the paint down first. Okay, let me take my bleach. This is for real bleach. It smells horrible and it looks like it's not gonna work. So, really bleach. All right, he's doing this. All right, Whew, I can breathe while I do this. That'd be great. <laughs> okay, at least it's showing up. This is really funny, actually. Oh my God, it's lightning. Okay, it's lightning. A lot. Why did I not think it was gonna do that? Our clouds are a little ugly. Kind of disappointed in that. All right, well, it's an abstract sort of sky. I also can't mix it with pink like he's doing because you can't mix color with bleach. It's just gonna turn white. This could still be a thing though. Mine's definitely gonna be a lot more abstract than his, but uh, oh no, you guys, this is not gonna work if I keep using bleach. They just go away and leave you. Bob. I can't do that because I'm using bleach. Just like so. Okay. Isn't that easy? We got a couple of happy little floaters up here. Let's build us a little mountain. Okay, maybe I can do this. Let's take blue and brown. Got it. Have a, a big ridge of mountains to live here. What we'll color is it? Don't worry about it. So I'm mixing black and blue. I know he said to do something something else, but I don't have any of those colors. To me, it just looks like dark blue. Over here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Okay, work, Brad, work. Because I could find freedom on this canvas. Oh, 
baby. I think we're all looking for freedom. At least I am. Me too. You cannot make a mistake in here. Mm. Okay. Doubt that. <laughs> I would love to actually follow one of these without using hair color. Because I feel like it would actually come out good. I'm blending my little heart away, honey. It's really trying for you. This bleach is looking a little crusty, but if we could just avoid using white for the rest of this, I'd really appreciate it. Okay, cool. Blow dry time. And let's begin putting some highlights and shadows. I'm gonna take some oh. titaniums to touch. Oh no. This knack has a straight edge on it. Bob, I can't do this. Here. I don't have white. Yeah. I'm regretting this decision not to use white paint. Okay, he said a little bit of bleach. I mean, <laughs> white paint. Okay, that doesn't look as bad as this guy does. <laughs> I hope you believe me that I'm literally using actual bleach right now. This is definitely not paint. Okay, that's the secret. I need to have really thick bleach. Damn boy. Okay. Got a little bit more white over here. So I put, I layered that that bleach over here so that we'd get more of a uh, white white. And I guess that's working. So it doesn't spread very nicely. Hey, Ugh. Ugh. Bleach is not working for me. I wonder why this doesn't look right. Oh yeah, cause I'm using bleach. Maybe that's why. Am I making this better or worse? I think this was a more abstract kind of guy. It looks a little better. I need to bring back those shadows, you know? Work, sis. I made it worse, I'm not gonna lie. Looks better, right? Now then, maybe there's some beautiful evergreens that live right there. Watch here. Just the corner of the brush. Just work it back and forth, back and forth. See there? Happy little evergreen, right there. It's a happy. friend. There he is. I am just waiting for these layers to dry and then adding more black over each layer because this is very liquidy and clear and these trees look like ass. They look like ass, so. <laughs> okay, I did that, man. I nailed that. I'd like to know who we're gonna be in your <laughs> Setting another tree. I like these little trees. They're fun to make. Really? Because I hate them. Honestly, they're the worst thing that's ever happened to me. Back to the damn white. A little bleach time. Let's try and make some, uh, some trunks, man. Why can't there just be one easy part? I'm literally just scraping off the paint. I'm gonna die. Okay, Bob. Now then, let's put some highlights. No, I don't feel comfortable, Bob, putting highlights, so... We're gonna go for it, man! We're gonna use some green and yellow. Hunter green and yellow. Yeah, making it look worse. Thanks, Bob. <laughs> These trees are hopeless. I'm hopeless. Everything's hopeless. <laughs> Moving on. You'll like it. I hate it. I hate everything about this. So stop trying to make okay. painting happen, Bob. It's not happening for me. Okay, little tree. Hang me and Bob Hang me trees. The browns. Shut up. Let's begin putting in some happy little bush shapes. Maybe there's a bush in there. A damn bush now? We don't make mistakes. No, um, we definitely do. Things come right now. It looks like a mess. Yeah. Like Let's see that again. Turn it into reflections, side with water and land. God, you really went for it. Not too much pressure. This is easy here. <laughs> I'm gonna dip my brush into some thinner. Shut up! I'm gonna make this a fall picture. Isn't that a beautiful color? No! Don't do this to me. My reflections look pissed. Not happy, man. That's they look right mad. Here. My paintings don't look like I'm a raging bitch then. <laughs> This is so bad. No, Bob, you know what? All I have to do to get white is just scrape the damn color off. We're gonna take white sienna, aka bleach. Then we make the reflections in the water. We just spool down on that. All right, Bob, give me the last touches, let's man. Let's get crazy. I'll let a little bit of it show through. What the f is that? Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna go for it. Let's go into here. The tree trunk. A little arm here. No! Oh, this one's so ugly. Oh no! 
that easy. What's easy? I mean, what's easy? Yellow ochre. Yellow ochre, a little ochre. My anxiety is hitting an all time high right now. Just have to Try, please. Just give me a break, man. Don't overdo. Don't, don't overdo. Bro, it's too late for not overdoing, sweetheart. Branches over here. <laughs> what are you? Just the indication of something. Ooh. And I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> Happy painting. God bless. Why are you leaving me, Bob? Bob, I need you. You are the only thing holding me together right now. <laughs> Don't ever try to paint with hair color and bleach, okay? Well, here you have it, guys. My masterpiece made out of only hair color and bleach. I'm gonna go ahead and say that this was such a fail. <laughs> And I'm sick of failing at these videos. When I try something new, I'm sick of it. I really put effort into this one. <laughs> it still looks so bad. The paint was too thin like I expected. It was more like watercolor. Wow, I just said water like a New Yorker. What a... You know, the bleach definitely ruined my life like I expected. It lightened all the paint and the only way of making it work is just layering it a ton of times till it's thick. But otherwise, it really, it didn't work out very well. Don't use bleach to paint. If you ever thought about doing that, just don't. Don't do it. But I think that I really excelled at these mountains. I think that they look fabulous. Everything else can probably just go. And hopefully one day I will succeed at a uh, video where I try something new. I don't want to lose anymore. Ah! So that's my Bob Ross painting using only hair color and bleach. I hope you guys enjoyed it and enjoyed watching my pain. And thank you. Don't forget to live your extra life, and I will see you all next time. Peace. Oh, this looks awful.